Welcome back to the Independent Investor Channel. This is Ryan here. So for you guys that have been following me for quite some time on YouTube, I've been doing this for about five years. I've enjoyed every minute of it. YouTube has been a, a, a long winding road. Uh, I, I started YouTube uh, not really understanding why I did it, except for the passion that I had for investing and the passion for helping people and also identifying that a lot of people needed help with financial stewardship and discipline. Uh, and, and I've realized that goal here, doing the project for what seems to be you know, a very short amount of time, but five years passes like that. And I have no doubt we'll be doing the project five, 10 more years down the line. I, I look at this project as being one of those things that's a lifelong project for me. And, and I'm excited to see it evolve. There's no way that when I started this project that I could have imagined where the project could go. Um, I thought maybe there's a potential to have, you know, 500,000 subscribers or, or that was the success on YouTube, uh, or maybe that it wouldn't go anywhere. Um, I was realistic about both. And I think in retrospect, it's ended up in a place that uh, I am super proud of. Uh, I enjoy the product. Uh, I don't feel stressed at all to make uh, content on YouTube. Uh, I do hold down a full-time job and YouTube has always been a side project for me, something that I pursue in my off time, uh, something that I've enjoyed building a community around a common theme. Uh, but just as of late here for about a year, a year and a half, I was approached by uh, a promotional agency. And I've been working with them for about a year and a half now. And I have been provided the opportunity to put out promotional content through YouTube. For you guys that are channel creators, this video is for you. So you need to listen up because of all the opportunities out there, the get rich schemes, the join, you know, whatever stock market group for ten, twenty thousand dollars $20,000 out there. Um, this I'm going to provide for you guys for free. Okay. Um, this opportunity came directly to me as I, as a channel with about 30,000 subscribers in, uh, in, I'm out there in the public light and I get approached all the time, solicited from deals over here, promoting products, um, the opportunity to come on and do small ad bits, this and that. Um, this particular company was one that uh, out of the hundreds of solicitations that I vet per year stuck. And uh, I do independent contracting with this company. And for any of the smaller YouTube channels out there, and I mean those that have as uh, little as a few hundred subscribers, 800, 1,000 subscribers, up to 5, 10, thousand up above 15,000. If you've ever uh, been curious about the opportunity of providing ad revenue or, or um, providing promotional content through YouTube, this is your opportunity. What I plan on doing is that for anybody that's interested in uh, pursuing this uh, as an option for themselves, uh, ask yourself, if you could use an extra $500 per month as a side hustle, if you did one project per month, um, you know, you, you could earn a few hundred extra dollars per month to help supplement your income. What you do with that money, I'm sure everybody out there can find a use case for those extra dollars. If you're working a day job like I do, I do this on the side. Okay. But I'll just have you know that I just came off of uh, September and into October uh, staring down over $12,000 of promotional uh, content put through YouTube. Uh, that is very real money and that is no BS. Okay. Uh, I'm making this video to actually share in the opportunity with you guys. I've been asked to um, solicit for assistance because here's the thing ad, ad revenue is being spent on a lot of different ways. Uh, traditionally, it's been to buy radio time. It's been spent buying commercials, which has driven the price up because those are the two realized means of pushing out awareness content on a specific product, whether it be a product or a company 
or, or anything that needs to be um, pushed out through uh, an audience. One thing that YouTube channel creators have been good at is garnering an audience. That's what we've done over the years. Now we've established our own niches on our specific channels and the ability to provide promotional services uh, for these ad companies uh, is critical in allowing these ad budgets to be spent in a way that allows us to target uh, the specific demographic of people who would uh, most be interested in that uh, specific content. So for you guys that have followed the Independence Investor Channel for a while now, you've seen a lot of different con uh, content come through. Uh, with the one company that uh, I'm looking to uh, find interested channels out there on, um, I do work with four other companies as well. So the opportunity in what I consider to be a blue ocean really speaks to the shift to YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and the like uh, with regard to uh, companies realizing the value proposition and putting those uh, uh, advertising dollars to work in a way that leverages the YouTube opportunity. And for content creators like myself who love doing the work, um, I spend a few hours per project and uh, I love doing it. It's a lot of fun. It exposes me to a lot of companies that I wouldn't have any, any business even knowing exist. Uh, furthermore, the opportunity to sit down with what seems to be almost a weekly basis, a different CEO uh, providing insight on the companies that they, that they represent. So what I plan on doing is I plan on uh, holding probably a meeting early next week. If you are interested in the opportunity, it's free. This is, uh, there's, no, there's no commitment at all. Uh, this is really just a call to action. If you feel like you want to earn some side hustle money, why do I do it? The Independence Investor Channel is um, a, a project that I enjoy wholeheartedly. And it is one of those that has been, um, I was one of the original YouTubers five years ago. I was there at, right at the beginning with Ryan Scribner's of the world, the Nate O'Brien's of the world, and Jeremy with financial education and the like. Uh, my channel hasn't seen the level of success that they had if success is deemed uh, uh, successful uh, by nature of the subscriber count that's had. Now, those larger channels are making good money on ad revenue. Smaller channels, they're not making that much on ad revenue. You guys have uh, seen the pennies that float in uh, per video. If you make a couple bucks per video, uh, the charge is to make content every single day to, to, be, to be relevant. And if you do that, you can actually make a pretty good side hustle as a small channel on YouTube. Um, I contend that if there's larger channels out there um, that can contend with my income for the last month, uh, which is well over $12,000, um, I, I would like to understand that. But here's the thing. I don't feel pressure at all to make content on YouTube at all. I, I use the channel uh, in a capacity that uh, allows me to do what I want, when I want, and how I want. Now, for you guys that are interested, what I need you to do is just send me an email. Very simple. I'll leave the email very simple in a comment pinned to the top of this video. All you have to do is say, hey, I'm, I'm interested. I will send you the link for a StreamYard meeting, uh, and I will give you guys an opportunity to Q&A me. You can ask me whatever you want. Um, if you need me to prove the income, I, that's kind of odd, but I, I will. It's no big deal. Um, I'm not one of those guys that comes on and brags up and down about making all kinds of money and that somehow you need to throw money at me uh, to make money. Make no mistake, this is about sharing an opportunity with you, okay? So I've already sent out uh, emails to my direct uh, uh, channels that I've supported over the years uh, because I think for a lot of people out there, I was starting making uh, these content videos with... Uh, about five or six hundred dollars per project, and uh, I was super stoked. 
Um, now I, I do the same level of work for significantly more because I've gained rapport with the company. Um, they know how receptive I am about taking projects on and I enjoy the work. I really do. I put together a good interview when I talk to CEOs. The whole idea is that you be yourself and, and provide the content the way that you best know how. Now, there's going to be people out there in the subscriber base that catch this and they, they, they don't like it. They don't like me. The irony in that is I do a Friday live stream every single Friday, taking time away from my family. Uh, I drop a link at the end of the Friday live stream and invite people in to talk directly to me free of charge. You know how many people take me up on that? Zero. Zero. Which speaks to the level of devotion that a lot of people have and the lack of commitment that people will have if they truly want to understand uh, what they need to understand about investing and especially investing to succeed. Okay. Now, this is an arm of the channel. I do podcasting. I make no money. Uh, I do uh, YouTube videos and I make very little money uh, through ad revenue. Uh, but uh, this is the most solvent. Uh, I have no guarantee that it's going to be this way for the next five years. I have no idea. I don't really care. And to each his own. If I've cured, uh, perked your curiosity, send me the email uh, to the link that I submit down in the comments section below and say, hey, Ryan, I'm interested. Thanks for reaching out. If not, I still love you. It's no big deal. You'll always be welcome as part of the independent investor community. And the whole idea here is to empower individuals to get where they want to go. A lot of people want to fire. They want to retire early. Great on you for doing it. How are you going to do it? You're going to do that work in a day job. Good luck to you. Are you going to save yourself to retirement? Good luck at that as well. I can tell you that a big, big part of my success is my side business that I have. I do work a nine to five job and I love it. I have no intentions at all of walking away because the fulfillment that I get from my daytime job is different than the fulfillment that I get from my YouTube project and the uh, interaction that I get with my community uh, when I put those arms of communication out there through social media. This is just one element of the channel that is uh, by far and away the most lucrative arm of the channel. And it'll continue. It's one of the most enjoyable things that I do and looking to share that opportunity with you guys. So again, hit me up. Uh, I will run the meeting as it's first come first serve. So if I run the meeting and there's nobody there, no love lost, I'll continue to do it myself. Uh, if you are interested in it, I have sent some direct comms uh, to some of my channels. Yep, that was me. <laughs> so uh, there's only one of me. So if you think you're being spammed by another Ryan, uh, you're not. That was actually me. Uh, call to action a little bit. If you've ever been frustrated a little bit from running a small YouTube channel because you're in a very, very red sea of 500 to 1,000 other YouTube channels, why don't you seek out a, a creative niche on the channel, start offering some promotional content, because what ends up happening is people start to see that content that you're putting out. And if it's quality content and you speak from the heart, you're, you know, doing due diligence on these companies that we're providing promotional content on, uh, the sky is the limit with regard to uh, it, uh, really expanding your reach with your channel, no matter how big or small your channel is. So guys, the email will be provided in the description below. If you do enjoy the content coming through the Independent Investor Channel, I highly encourage you to get on board right now. Subscribe to the channel. It's a great opportunity. If you do know people out there that do run YouTube channels, the, it's an open invite. It's no problem. If you've ever wondered you know, what, what the payout structure is like, kick into the meeting that I'm going to run on StreamYard early next week. I'm going to put out a solicitation to everybody who responds to me. Uh, and I'll run the meeting. If there's one person in the meeting, great. If I have 100 people hit me back up, then we will run 10 successive meetings. But it is first come, first serve, and I will be taking tabs on who reaches out to me first. If nobody does, great. 
I'll continue to kick ass myself. It's no big deal. If you want to take me up on this opportunity, please do. If not, no love lost. I still love you. You'll always be part of the independent investor community, but I look to see you on the other side within the stream yard. Guys, thank you so much for tuning into this video and good luck in your investment future.